Fox tonight, crews are battling a fire in Salem that broke out this afternoon. At last check, that fire had grown to 100 acres. Fox 12's Chandler Watkins joins us in Salem and has the latest on what's being called the Liberty Fire. Chandler? Yeah, we're at Judson Middle School, which is where those who were under that level three evacuation were told to go. Just a few minutes ago, we started hearing that those evacuations had been lifted. We're still awaiting that official confirmation from officials at this time. But the Red Cross has been here all afternoon. They say they helped around 50 people and they'll remain on standby overnight in case they're needed. Marion County Sheriff's Office, level three, go down. Crews responded to a grass fire that broke out in the Jory Hill area, south of Salem, just before 3 p.m. Wednesday afternoon. Once the fire spread to approximately 100 acres, we started the level three evacuation at approximately 315. We're told 630 evacuation notifications went out to residents in the area. We could see the fire. It wasn't, it wasn't like we were in any danger, immediate danger. So we just waited until the sheriff showed up and said, you have to go. The areas for evacuation are between Cole Road, Jory Hill, Bates, to the north, Davis. So the western boundary as well, that'll be Skyline Road, be from Davis down to, uh, I believe, Moore. Officials tell us at least two outbuildings were damaged, but there were no known injuries at this time. Seven different agencies with 70 units came together to battle the Liberty Fire. Three planes also provided air support. Several under the level three evacuation were at Judson Middle School. Others got hotels, and one family we spoke to and their cat were receiving help from a community member. A woman uh, drove up, I don't remember her name, but we got her information. She saw us standing here and said, I'm a property manager. I've got a couple places that are vacant over in West Salem. They're really nice apartments. You can have one for the night. So Again, just a few minutes ago, we're hearing that evacuations have been lifted. We're still awaiting that official confirmation. But as this is a developing story, we'll continue to keep you updated on air and online. Reporting in Salem, Chandler Watkins, Fox 12, Oregon.